Here on a Mac, you don't usually see the sizes of folders, but you can by going into the folder view options and pressing calculate all sizes. So you can see over here that I have a size option in my uh, filtering menu here, which we can right click on this and select size just to make sure we see size. But right now it's not showing anything. Now if I go inside of this folder structure or I kind of toggle it down, I can see if I dive far enough to see some kind of file, I can see the sizes of the files, but I don't see the sizes of the folders. What we can do to see folder sizes is select the folder you want to see all the sizes of that folder and everything inside of it, and then go to your view dropdown, and then go to show view options. The shortcut key for this is command J. It's one that I've learned a lot when I try to do this. So you press command J and it shows the view options. And at the bottom of view options, it's actually calculate all sizes. So when we check mark this, you can see that all the sizes pop up. Now I'm gonna give you one word of advice here. You can also see that the sizes slowly come in. So these uh, folders will actually generate their sizes over time as they kind of figure out the sizing of what's inside of them. It takes a minute to calculate sometimes, especially when you have gigabytes and gigabytes of data. Now a couple other things. First, this folder in particular is actually shared cloud storage, which means this icon here for me, which is a Google Drive, uh, icon says it's not downloaded. So the folder itself is only six kilobytes, but some of these others that are downloaded do show the full size of the contents in the folder. So it, you may have to download some of your cloud storage to actually show how large of a folder it is, but you can see how now we can see all of the different folder sizes within this folder structure just by pressing that Command J shortcut key and selecting Calculate All Sizes. Now we can do this even at the higher level of just the entire Macintosh hard drive. If you were to go to your Macintosh HG, press Command J, and then do Calculate All Sizes, that will start to populate the sizes over here. But like I said, it's going to take a while if you're doing your whole computer. You could dive down into your system and applications, and you'll see some of these will start to populate quicker than others. So applications populated pretty quick, and it might still be populating. There's no real loading bar here. It does take some time. But if you're in a folder that just has a certain amount of items, and you want to know the sizes of the folders in there, well, it's pretty quick to just calculate all sizes of some of those folder structures rather than your entire Mac. And you can see as it's building down the list of all the sizes, some of these are actually synced and some aren't. And you can see the sizes of what is and what isn't. That's how to calculate folder size here on a Mac.